Yo, what's up guys? Dave here and uh, I'm going to show you this uh, video of uh, something I did to all my vents in the uh, camper here. Um, so I got everything prepped and the reason why I did that is because um, you have to separate the uh, foil from the tape on this uh, foil tape and um, that seems to uh, take the longest of uh, everything. So what I'm going to do is I want to put this down here and let's get you set and I'm going to show you what we're going to do here. So uh, basically what we're going to do is we're going to foil tape the inside of this here because you see how you see how I could lift up the linoleum here. Well, what could happen is during your heating season is your air will blow out of these heat ducts and could go in between here and create a bubble in your floor because this floor is not glued down throughout the whole camper as you can see it's movable um, there are spots it's glued down but it's not glued down throughout the whole camper so what we're going to do is we're going to foil tape this whole thing uh, so air cannot get underneath and in between here all right so um couple of things we're going to do uh, which we've actually pre-done um, so you can kind of see in here it's nice and clean um, there was some sawdust in here uh, I, which I vacuumed out and uh, everything else is pretty good uh, the cut looks good I got a little bit here which I could just take my pocket knife and run it run it down to just take that out all right what we're gonna do all right the key with this foil tape is when you put this on um, you got to remember that this cover comes out to about right there so if you go more than about a quarter of an inch over the floor uh, it's a possibility that you could see that uh, foil tape while you're done so let's just make sure we uh, we don't go more than a quarter inch all right so we put this foil tape on and What you want to try to do is get this so it's not wrinkled at all. All right. Yeah, that's probably about the maximum amount. All right, so we got one piece on. Um, this is a pretty, this is a pretty quick, um, fix here so we don't get that foil in there um, so we don't get the air coming up through uh, the foil will seal it up the seals and I'll show you close up Pretty much all you got to do here for foil wise you can see that that was relatively easy to do um, the next thing we're gonna do is I have these filters here and we're gonna put these filter inside the grate so that um, not using it for filtering purposes as much as I'm using it for uh, debris falling down into the duct so 
uh, pretty simple is you just flip it over and push it in um, you know I guess if you wanted to restrict flow you could probably put two or three of these in um, I don't want to restrict flow so that's kind of what that looks like and put this on It's all sealed. Uh, no air will flow through and around this heat duct. Uh, any air that flows will come up through here. And with this uh, nice filter in there, uh, debris will not go uh, down into here um, and get caught within the heat ducts. Um, you know, in case you're wondering uh, why. Come here, bud. This is Dusty. And we're trying to keep his hair out of there. All right, buddy? Say bye. <coughs> All right, see ya.